Good morning, Hero Wars fans. This video will be a skill explanation of Chorus. Please note that the content of this video may be incorrect due to the fact that it was produced before Chorus was implemented in the game. Let me explain the two skills, Gray and Green skill, as Team Pet in Chorus. Flock's Vengeance Gray skill. Open per 3 seconds, Chorus charges 1 rune in the runic circle. He also charges, max 20, when enemies apply certain control effects. When the runic circle is activated, Chorus deals damage over time to the enemy that has applied the most control effects. A different amount of runes is charged for different control types, 3 for silence, 2 for charm, and 1 for blinding, stun, and mind control. The indomitable. Green skill. Passive skill. Enables each ally to block certain control effects. Effects blocked by this skill charge runes in Chorus Runic Circle. The following control effects trigger this skill, Silence, Charm, Blinding, Stun, and Mind Control. So far, I have explained the two skills, Gray and Green skill, that Chorus has as a team pet. From here on, I will explain the bonus skill that Chorus grants to the owner of a pet as a support pet. Patron skill, Purple skill. Bonus status, Magic attack, Armor. The owner and two allies with intelligence as their main stat that stand in front of the owner and behind them are granted a resilience aura. The owner with the resilience aura convert 50% of magic damage they deal into shield. The allies with the resilience aura convert 25% of magic damage they deal into shield. The shield absorbs some of the physical damage taken. The damage absorbed scales with the hero's missing health. I hope this explanation has given you an idea of chorus abilities as a team pet and as a support pet. My personal focus will be on Chorus skill as a support pet. In Arena and Guild War, Chorus can be selected as a support pet for mage type heroes, even if Chorus is not selected as a team pet. 50% of the magic damage inflicted by the owner of Chorus on the enemy is converted into a shield that absorbs physical damage. In addition, heroes with intelligence as their primary status, located before and after the owner of Chorus, also convert 25% of the damage they inflict on the enemy into a shield. In other words, if a team composition consists of three heroes with intelligence as their primary status, their defense against physical attack is further enhanced by the effect of Resilience Aura. For example, a team composition with three heroes in a row, such as Krista, Celeste, and Lars, would allow all three heroes to have Resilience Aura shields. Devising a team composition with heroes lined up in this manner could transform a magic attack team composition into a more powerful team composition than it has been in the past. This could have a major impact on the style of combat in future Hero Wars. Incidentally, Chorus can support these 14 heroes, so if your opponent's team composition includes these 14 heroes, you may not be able to win as much as you would like with a traditional Hero Wars fighting style. Well, the image here is a list of heroes that affect Chorus Gray and Green skill when Chorus is fighting on the battlefield as a team pet. At this time, it is not known how the skill activated by the opposing team pets Fenris and Mara will affect Chorus skill activation. For this reason, I have included the skills of Fenris and Mara in this material. Please note that skill number 1 and skill number 2, which are activated by Fenris and Mara, may not affect Chorus Gray skill and Green skill. Well, Chorus seems to be, for all intents and purposes, a pet that was created as a countermeasure against Isaac, but how did the viewers feel about it? Kenru would like to ask a favor of you who have watched the video to this point. If this video made you laugh and feel happy, please share the URL link to this video with your guildmates in your guild. Thank you for watching the video until the last part. I'll see you in my next video.